A wise man once told me to not put my finger in plug sockets. I didn't listen to him. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome your faces to the vlog. <laughs> and just like that, we can speak. So hello new dawn, hello new day. What a beautiful way to start my day. Oh yeah. Now it has to be said for the record that I am very happy starting this day because I managed to wake up and be out of bed by 9.30. This barn is getting chopped in T minus two hours. So stop with the comments. And hopefully if we head to the garden, we should see some progress. So let's go and check on it after we say hello to Kevin. Hello there. Oh. For 12 hours, I have left this project pouring out into the culvert. And we're about to find out if we've had any success. Because today's the day I would like to start dismantling the pool. But where is it up to? Progress, progress, pro... <gasps> Progress! Oh my goodness, I cannot believe how successful that has been! Flipping heck, I honestly thought we'd be waiting like another 6 to 12 hours to empty it, but the two hose pipes have done a cracking job. Now as we can see, there's obviously a bit more left in there, but the hose pipes are still in, so I wonder if they're still draining. Honestly, I'm in a little bit of awe this morning. It's not even 10 a.m. But do we still have suction? No flipping way! It's working like a charm! And both hose pipes are still working. So I tell you what, if we go and get our hair cut, come back later on this afternoon, it might be empty. And we'll be moving on to stage two, which will be known as Destruction Day. I am one happy chap. And I hope I've received a phone call saying someone's outside my house. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Would you look who it is? I wasn't expecting this this morning. Oh. It feels like last year I saw you. Uh, a year ago. I've, I've yeah, it was it. A year How are you doing? Oh! I like the hat. Yeah, I love this hat. I got it from Scotland. It's a great look. Nice tracksuit, by the way. Oh, tell me you're not impressed. No, I do. It works. It's a shame that it comes it to an scary. end, but it, it's no, it's it served its purpose and it's done now. It's like the life of Tom's back. Look at this. <laughs> the random adventures. The gang's all here. Take a look. Look at that. All the effort we put into building this and now we're stabbing holes in it to get the rest of the water out. It's a sad day. <laughs> And I've got a feeling I know why Thomas Upton's here. So if you're new around here or you missed the last few vlogs, I got these glasses which have a camera built into them. Not these ones, these are just my normal seeing glasses. But I went out with them in my Defender and I went splashing around in puddles. Roll the clip. Oh! <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> And Tom's come knocking on my door this early in the morning, which makes me think he's found some bigger puddles. So go on then, where have you found the puddle? What puddle? There's, oh, no, there's a reason why you've turned up in your 4x4 with a snorkel on. <laughs> ah! Okay, now tell me what you found. Where the uh, flex is disconnected. Good spot. <laughs> I've just seen it straight away. No way! And the other one. Wait, both are disconnected. 100%. No way! Out of the entire tree, anywhere you could look, there is where the lights are disconnected. What a way to start a day. I can't believe you spotted that. I can't believe you've just admitted this to me. Steve Pete's gone. What? No! The, the silhouette of Steve Pete that I set all my fireworks off on, he's finally disappeared. In the arms of an angel. Where are you? Right, we've got about an hour yeah. before I need to get my hair cut. Are we going saying hello to a certain puddle? Yeah. Yeah. My boy! Good morning! Good morning, little dude! Good morning, little weed! Today's the day. I finally got a haircut. I'm so sorry I've looked like this for so long. I apologise! Don't judge me for what I look like wearing these this glasses. Is right. I look really good, mate. Switching to glasses cam. Ah, what do you think? Hey, well, it's it's got an LED light to let you know that you're recording. So imagine if I'm stood like that and you didn't know you're recording, it can be a bit creepy, can't it? So it's got a light to let you know that I'm recording. But what do you think? Wow, wow, we were. Wow, nice suit, nice, nice, nice tracksuit. Where'd you get that from? Syndicate, really. Didn't really look after that one, did you? Mate, they're so comfy. Wow. Oh. I'm sorry. oh, Andy, where'd you get that hat from? Right, yeah. Syndicate. <laughs> <laughs> Joking. Right, is it go time? Go time. Sweet. Right, See you in a minute. Okay, here's to hoping we don't get stuck. I have to take my car as well. Like, I know Tom's has got the snorkel and everything, but come on. The beast from the east needs to be in its natural habitat. And with the glasses cam, this should be pretty fun. So, hi ho, Silver! Away! On this episode of Moments Before Disaster Caught on Camera, 
Tom Cassell and Tom Upton head to the Highland Peaks to find themselves a puddle. I'm not entirely sure where Tom is taking me. Um, all I know is that I cannot miss my haircut appointment. He said it's on, on the way, but I'm sure he's just saying that to make me get out <laughs> and come and play. Oh, I know where we're going. This should have been a no-brainer. Literally going down Green Lane. <laughs> Look at of, of course, this is where he takes me. This is Tom's version of off-roading. Of, of off the one lane in our area that's just got a million potholes in. And you know what? The whole reason for me ever wanting land is just to be able to do this sort of stupid shit. It may seem so mundane to people like, why do you want to drive through puddles? But the answer is, there's something just so satisfying about it. Like, it, it, it ticks that in a... <laughs> and you just have to love it. It's just so satisfying. <laughs> it's not really for those with motion sickness, just throwing that out there. Oh, it's getting tight down here now, ain't it? I know actually where we are because this is where um, I come mountain biking sometimes and we absolutely fly down here. To which I know exactly which puddle we're heading to. I guarantee right in front of him now, there is an absolutely gigantic puddle. I've ridden through it in my bike and it is treacherous. I've just pulled up here to the side because I can already see it. Look just above Tom's car. You can see like an abyss of a puddle dead ahead. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh, look at the size of that thing. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> You are my kind of man. Oh, this is mint. I don't know what's so satisfying about it, but it's just, it's mega. Oh, yes, 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 and more yes. I love Tom. I need to go on more adventures with him all the time. Oh, it's, it's the simple things. It is the simple things. Mate, I absolutely I like love you. I was like, no, I thought my glasses weren't recording one of the clips. I was like, no, oh. and I just checked and we were. Bet you any yeah. money, you end up coming back with GoPros all over you. Oh no, I'm 100% coming back with like the 360 cam and stuff like that, but I'm saying this now, we, we need to really get into green lighting. Yeah, we need to find some good ones. I was in the pub like last Saturday talking to someone about it and they were like, I know loads of places, so yeah. I might have a good contact for us. Yeah, yeah. The gang's back together! <laughs> Nothing like giving your car a nice wash in the morning. Oh, I so know the footage would look so much better if I was like using, you know, like the latest GoPro and stuff like that. And I could easily set it up, but do you know what? Just for you guys to be able to like experience this from like my perspective, I think it's such a cool like angle. It's just, it's just a, a really awesome way of doing it. Like the moment they can make it so it's not vertical and it does like my entire view. Wow. Absolutely game changing. I'm starting to think I know where we're going because up there I can see the hills. We're going to the dales we are. Um, the hills are that way, but we're going this way. And it says unsuitable for motor vehicles. <laughs> Laughs in Land Rover Defender. Ooh, okay, me likey, me likey. Go on, Tom, where are you taking us? Uh, why is he going in reverse? Is he switching it to four by four mode? I think he might be doing. Hmm. Potentially a good time for me to do so as well. Right, let's get us into 4x4 mode. <coughs> Look at this. When you're in 4x4 mode in the Defender, it auto crawls by itself. Look at this. So it's just pulling itself along. It's so cool. Okay. Let's hope I can actually get up here and we don't get stuck. <laughs> Well, to look at Tom go! Oh my gosh! Amazing! This is wicked! Oh, if I end up missing my haircut, man, I'm gonna be fuming! Look at him go! We're about to look like we're going sideways. Dun, 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 dun. Go on, the boy! Go on, the defender! Keep her going! Keep her going! More power! More power! 
More energy! Right, big water barge here. Uh, go on, get over it, get over it. Yes! Oh, this is wicked. There's no way we've ended up doing this today. I'm so freaking stoked. Oh my gosh, go on, Defender. Go on, Defender. Go on, what on earth? Right, I reckon we've got this. We've so got this. Go on, go on, go on. Get the wheels in the right place. Yes. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. This is gnarly, man. Oh, this is a bit brutal. I mean, it needs some power here. There we go, there we go, there we go. Go on, yes. We smoked that bit. Right, please be high enough to clear that. I don't hear any banging. I think we're right okay. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm going to have to show you where, where I just went up there. That was wicked. Oh my gosh, we are coming back with GoPros. Look at that we just cleared. It might not look steep on camera, but I tell you what, it is. All right, let's catch up with Upton because he's been a good guide to follow. All right, let's keep her going. More power. More energy. Look at this. Oh, the defenders absolutely smoked this. Like, honestly, there wasn't there wasn't a single moment I was worried there in the slightest. But that was absolutely wicked. This is the first time I've properly done something like that with the defender. Yes. You're not about to tell me that there's a post in the way, is there? There's, there's no way. Is there a post at the top of the road? Oh, is there? <laughs> <laughs> well then, well, isn't that an interesting uh, predicament? If only I had my angle grinder with me. <laughs> no! Well, I reckon I could, you can fit through that. I know, it's just if it's looked down, isn't it? Mate, you can fit through that. Easily. Look at the size of your car, it's tiny. Content. Hey, and what a difference of lifestyles, off-roading in the mud, and that's the plane you can shower on just flying over. Wow. Oh, he's actually giving it up. Oh, loads of room, Tom. Yeah, easy, easy, easy. Yeah, you're good. Loads on this side. Don't you like how I'm giving all this advice and I've never green laned before in my life? <laughs> no, he's gonna, he's gonna you're right, you reckon? Right, stop. Tom, stop. Reverse a little bit. Reverse a little bit that way, like back it in. You fa trust me. Creep, 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 creep. Slow that this way a bit. This way a bit now. Creep slowly, slowly. Creep, 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 creep. creep. Done. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hey, it's like he knows what he's doing. Now it's my time to smash my defender to pieces. Hey! What's the worst that can happen, eh? Da 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 da. We good? Perfect. Done. Yeah, you're out. Sharp. Did you just say sharp turn to somebody who owns a defender? <laughs> Lovely. Like a motherfucking glove, bitch! <laughs> Yes! Oh, I didn't record it. Ah, there we go. Ah, yes, no, you know, did not do. Yes! I love it! Right, I gotta go for my haircut. <laughs> what a day. Just. <laughs> what a day. I can't believe since I decided to get up at 9 o'clock in the morning and start my days earlier, I've just been getting so much more shit done, having so much fun, and I've still got my entire day ahead of me. Just brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Oh, can't believe it. I've made it for the first time in history to the barbers early. I'm hoping to come out looking like a new man after this. <sighs> this is so not fair. You pull them off like the coolest person in the world. I look, I look like Inspector Gadget wearing them. Beats on it there. No. Hey. <laughs> look at the whole shop trying on the glasses. <laughs> Mate, that is fucking sick. Technology, eh? I know. <laughs> Glad you'll be getting a zero on top and a four on the sides if I wear these. <laughs> How cool are them? Yes! Oh. <laughs> Feeling fresher than a mother trucker. Oh my gosh. Aaron Simpkins, Alexander Barbers, the goat. Oh, go on then. I'll grab a coffee for the road from Gladstones. Don't mind if I do. You son of a bitch. 
Thank you very much. I appreciate you. What a legend. <laughs> Just gave me a coffee for free. See you later, mate. Yes, go on then. Absolutely brilliant. Well, I don't remember I just got that for free for showing off my glasses, but absolute legends there. Just gave, gave me a coffee for the road for free. What a day. Look at that. Didn't have to pay for parking, didn't have to pay for a coffee. I'm going to have to pass it forward some way today. <laughs> and look how dirty this thing's looking. I actually thought it didn't look too bad, but it's now got this like dry layer of mud across it. I like it. I like it a lot. Wow. Right. This is the final clip probably of me wearing my glasses today. Let me know what you think of it and if it's a bit too much. Obviously if I go and do green laning and stuff like that, I will most likely use my GoPro because it's just better quality camera and stuff like that. I'd rather it be, you know, the full screen. But I think for little clips throughout the day, it's still a pretty solid show. I, I'm, I'm a fan and everyone seems to love them. I just don't want people to be freaked out when I'm recording, but with the light, I think we're okay. Now, I am heading home because I have a bit of an adventure to go on with Lydia. But seeing as though I now know I can head up this road, take a left, take a right, take a left, take a right, um, and be off-roading, I'm going to take a little detour on the way home. <laughs> <laughs> because why take the road when you can take the railway bridge? Oh yeah! Oh no! There's a van coming down. Thank God I spotted it. I really need to know the, the rules of green laning of like who's got right of way in certain areas but I think it's just common sense and politeness that if you can let someone go, you just let them go. Beep! Beep, 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 beep. All right, let's wait for the van. Could have found myself in a right predicament then. Eh? I would have found myself in a right predicament then. I, don't, I can't believe he's come over there in a van. In a van? Yeah. I, I, thought it, I thought I saw a tractor at first and I was like, no. No, it looks like a white van. It looks like a DPD delivery van. Yeah. <laughs> You've just got to love the beautiful natural countryside of Gyra. Oh my gosh. I love, oh, maybe I should put my window up a bit. Let me neck. Oh, <laughs> now, I'm going to do my windscreen wipers on for this one. <coughs> now I don't have a Thomas Upton uh, in front of me, I can actually uh, fly through some of these potholes, seeing as though I know they're not dangerous. I feel like I'm dodging minefields. Look at the state of this thing. Whoa, someone's building a house. <laughs> it's for horses. I am, I am aware of it. Look at this. Look at the size of that puddle. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes! Get us through it! Get us through it! Oh! Absolutely beautiful! And go on then! Keep her going! Keep her going! Keep her going! Oh! <laughs> yes! Oh, it's the little things in life! One small step for man! One giant leap! For my leak issue! Uh! <laughs> oh! Things you love to see! <laughs> You've just got to love how the Defender just made absolute light work of everything there. B-E-A, beautiful, and we're back on the road. Good lad. Do you know what I've just realised I need now? Is that massive puddle, but I'm pretty sure it's gone, because if the massive puddle was there, I could just fly through it and wash my vehicle. 200 IQ, down the drain. <laughs> Literally. Oh, look who's in the office. Wonder if that will get her attention. I doubt it because she's got the shutter half down to stop the sun. Oh, I don't believe it. I don't, I don't believe it. You're back in work. Now, I know you're going to hate me. I think we should use code FUN, F-U-N, for 10% off everything for the next 24 hours. Okay, fine, yeah. Yay! <laughs> oh, you can't. <laughs> Use the code to go to City Grimmage now and get 10% anything you order. Hey! There you go. There's the hoodie. Thank you. With the bigger lion. I'll try it. I'll Prepare compare it. To I will. Let me know what you prefer. I will. You've not even complimented me. Yeah, it's right. Ah! Yeah, I know. Very good, very good. I'm now going out on a adventure date with Lydia because guess what? Like a child. Well, he's not fucking in here, is he? But speaking of which, it's my son's two month birthday today. Oh! Where are you going? He's two months old. It's a surprise, it's a secret. Yeah. We're not going to the traffic center. Just before anyone suggests, fucking hell. I feel like a new man. <laughs> I feel like a new man, I'm so happy. And by the way, these glasses, I've had so many compliments. Really? So many people have tried them on and seen what they think of them. Like, 
Love them. Oh, brilliant. Thank you. You're Such a good girl. She's the best gift giver. The, 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 the gift face. giver. <gasps> My boy! My there. boy! What are you doing? He's reading that that says Merry Christmas and he's like, Mum, it's not Christmas anymore. We've still got two more days of decorations. Take two more days of decorations. <gasps> Hey, hi my boy. Hello, is daddy home? Is daddy home? I can't wait to take you off road in adventure when you're older. And then you can do it in your own little defender. Okay, I need to put the glasses back on charge because I've absolutely zapped them. I've probably done like 20 or 30 minutes worth of recording of them. And to recharge them, you just put them back in the case. And just like that, jobs are good. One. Along with the refreshing shower. I know this is going to seem weird, but I always shower after I go to the barbers. I hate that feeling of hair. And I know barbers do everything in the power to try and stop any going down like your back or in your ears or anything like that, but it's always there. I am aware. So I shower it all off and I am feeling fresh. But I am less sad. I'm wearing a shirt right now, which is not Syndicate original. I'd rather be wearing a nice t-shirt with the embroidered stuff that we have on. It's called the Signature Collection. I think I got that right for once. But unfortunately, all my clothes I pretty much own are in the washing there. Because this is my dirty laundry pile, I just throw it into there, close the doors, and then hopefully it magically appears in my wardrobe one day. Thanks to a fantastic person known as Beth. But okay. It's time for a family fun day out. And yes, I know I still need to grind down the pool. We'll do that when I get back, if I have time. And I'm not sure who selected your outfit, but you and me are matching my boy. Look at him. In never letting you know my next move, um, I've got a surprise. In the form of a box, which my mum gave me yesterday. So let's see what's inside. To which I have no idea and oh, what is this? There is a letter. And in said letter, it says, dun -dun 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 -dun, a gift for you. Hmm. To Tom, Lydia and Alfie, wishing you a very Merry Christmas. Uh, well, we've got the tree up still, so that kind of counts. This this is well, this is this year's Harrods Christmas bear, and we thought it'd be lovely keepsake for little Alfie. We hope you have a lovely Christmas. Love from Ellie and Sadie from Brighton. Oh, oh, and how lovely is that? Look at the size of it. Oh, it's gorgeous. It is really branded in Harrods. Look, it's gonna have his hat and everything. Oh, Ellie and Sadie, thank you so much for that. That's adorable. Looks like the days of me getting packages are gone, cause they're all for you my friend look at it it's kind of stunned like what am i supposed to do with this thing <gasps> whoa what's that he has no idea the bear actually has a name and it is called ethan the christmas bear alfie ethan ethan alfie Enjoy. Now, speaking of shout outs, I need to shout out these legends on these pictures, which you cannot see. But now you can, and I need to say thank you to Rachel and Sam because they got me a lovely birthday gift when we went off to Ibiza, and I'm only just now redeeming it. So if you just look at that view, because that is where we're going. Oh, the power of teleportation. Come, come, Chad. Come, come. You know, you've got to get a vlogger who can do it both. Like, this morning, I'm, I'm draining pools, green laning, and now, we're doing a bit of city life. Oh, if you're not, it, it's your second month birthday. Listen, if you're not subscribed, you've got to do. And my son, welcome to Greater Manchester. We're on today's trip to town. We can thank Sam and Rach for an absolutely amazing birthday gift of a hundred pound voucher to the Ivy. So that is where we're going. And have you been sick? He's been sick. Yeah, big sausage. Oh, look at this place. It's like magic. Look at this. What a lovely place to come on a dinner date. Center of town. Don't mind if we do. We've been here less than 30 seconds and a certain someone has sprung on your daddy. <laughs> I said, do you want us next to him? I said, and he went, oh yeah, I'll sit next to him. I was literally about to film a clip being like, look at us, suited and booted, looking all cute, it's adorable. However, I am not suited and booted, but he then decided to sick on me. No regrets. It's such your top bird, He's completely matching. And it's okay, you can throw up on me whenever you want, and I'm sure when you're 18, you'll be doing a lot of it then. But what do you think of the place? Wow. Pretty magical and wowzers. Mama looking pretty hot, right? Mama looking pretty hot. Ooh, so what are we having for a starter? Ooh. We have to do a starter, right? We have to do it properly. Wait, what? Salt yeah, salt and pepper's good for me, for sure. And then for Maine, hmm. I kind of like the idea of the chicken supreme. Mmm, with truffle sauce. I would chef's kiss right now. But um, I'm holding on to a monkey. Lydia has now taken control of the baby who is very tired. And a toast. Should I pass you? Oh, I was going to pass you yours. A toast. 
after two months of little dude. Oh, he's falling asleep. I love you. I appreciate you. And thank you for everything. He's falling asleep. Uh, <laughs> hey, thank you for him. Oh, big yawn. I contact him. He's going. He is going. Look at this guy. He's fighting with all his might to try and keep his eyes open. But he is one tired baby. <laughs> you know, as a kid, when your parents go, right, time to go to bed, you're tired, and you're like, I'm not tired yet. <laughs> and you wake up like 20 minutes later. That's exactly what he's doing right now. Salt and pepper squid starter and scallops. Mm. It has to be said. Mm. Them scallops. Phenomenal. Come on now. Th these are good selections. Lobster linguine is what we went for. And then we changed it to another chicken dish, which is called brick roast chicken. And that looks good. I know this is not sort of the way to do things, but I'm going for a finger taste test review of that sauce. So glad we're sharing. That's good. And Lydia quickly takes a bite before Alfie wakes up. And the mm. survey says, yeah. Oh, the one-handed diner said really good. But before I try this chicken, I'm gonna have to showcase the crisp. Listen, listen to how crispy. Uh, this is this is definitely not coming across on camera. Orion, play chainsaw sounds. Wow, look how crispy that is. <laughs> this smells amazing and looks amazing. Mmm. Mmm. And tastes amazing. And that sauce with mushroom. Phenomenal. Was I wrong? Or was I right? That is so good in it. That is a that's a that's a good dish. And now we're going to try the lobster linguine, which I spilt. That's good. I two good dishes. You do, but I am saying it. That's good, but that is way better. That's getting like a nine, a nine point one. Dinner. Delicious. Yes, some truffle chips may have appeared to have, have, have magically popped up on my plate. And would you look at that, a certain someone is now awake. <laughs> oh, his face is like, whoa, I'll be here with my daddy. That's what you call good timing, but I now have to question, what have you ordered? Because I can see something that's got me going, what is that? Because I ordered a latte for dessert, 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 and what is this? Whoa, I didn't know what I ordered. Uh, exactly. Happy, happy, it's his two month birthday. So happy two month birthday, little dude. But I've got a feeling this is just for mum. <laughs> oh, amazing. Oh. Get light and everything. Oh, that's adorable. Happy two months to you. Happy two months to you. Happy two months to Alfie. Happy two months to you. Hip hip, hooray. Uh, it's ice cream. Yeah. Right, he's gonna blow it out though. Did you make a wish? Yeah. What did you wish for? I'm not telling you. Yeah, it was a test, you passed. Do you know what I was gonna ask? Is that edible? But it looks like tin file. I think it's tin file. Oh, it is tin file. I yeah, it's cold. Yeah. Don't eat that. Oh, no way. I don't know whether they think it's our actual birthday, but we did say it's his two month birthday. And by the way, no, we're, not, we're not weird parents. We're like, oh, we're gonna celebrate every month in like some crazy extravagant yeah, way. The first month we did is an actual Chinese tradition. Two months isn't, we just thought we'd come out to celebrate it and we had a voucher to come in. Um, but yeah, we'll take two desserts. That means you just gotta eat more. Cause I don't really do desserts. I love my food, but I'm just not, a, I'm not a sweet person. Mm. Mm -mm. You get to pull it out and I'll make wish. I can make a wish for him. Mm -hmm. I made one of these. I made a good wish. And I'm not telling you what it is. Here we see the life of a sugar cube. What a life it will live. Adventure it might, but not today. You do put brown sugar cubes in coffee, right? Oh, look. We do now. Cheers. That's hot. Luckily I finished my latte because I now need to run off. Lovely to see you. And I need to get my coat and we've got less than 60 seconds before our parking runs out on the car. So, see you in a bit. Just abandoned in Mrs. and the child. Talk about convenient timing. Look who I've just bumped into. Speed walk, speed walk, speed walk. I'm just parked around that corner there and them guys are most likely about to walk up and take a left. So hopefully if I'm fast, 
we should be a okay but um i just got the notification on my phone on my app saying uh, your parking has expired and fingers crossed we're fine oh i don't see any parking ticket attendants as i've Bed right past them. Oh, perfecto mundo. This is now a really random statement of me, but if I was to ever live in Manchester anywhere, I would actually live on this road. I think they're all like, like office blocks or something, but I just think they're so beautiful that these would be the houses I'd want to live in. I wouldn't want no like massive high rise skyscraper or anything. I'd want one of these. Thought you needed to know that for whatever reason. All right, let's go and get the baby. Um, Uber for uh, Lydia? Uh, Uber for Alfie? <laughs> Listen, mate, you gotta love it when a plan comes together. The ivy, you were lovely. Okay, I literally drove you around the corner. That'll be £58.577. Thank you. Not even kidding, we actually just drove around the corner to uh, just find a different street parking bay. I'm in the line, shut up. And from here, we're actually gonna go to um, some shops. And as I was saying before, going from off roading to out on the streets of Manchester, we do it all. And we're gonna park into Selfridges and Co to buy ourselves a new fridge. <laughs> Can you believe with a name like that you can't even buy a fridge? It's just ridiculous. Come, 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 come. No, 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 no. Totally nearly just broke an elevator and trapped my chair. Wrong floor. My bad. <laughs> Sorry about that, dude. I thought we had enough time to get through it. May or may not have just uh, trapped the child in the door. My bad. Oh, he's so oh. now. It was a one time occurrence. Unbelievable. But you can start to smile because guess what? Oh my gosh. Jelly cats. Hey. Quick, take them all and don't tell your mother. Well, we bought him a two month present of a little baby girl and he fell asleep. So, okay, we're now on the hunt for me for a jacket. And so far, I'm not really seeing anything that's ticking the boxes of what I'm after. I'm not even 100% sure what I want. I just want like a nice going out jacket that's not like this. It's not dead heavy and it's not like my denim, like off-white jacket oh that's nice <laughs> even if i was to say i like that i feel like if i wore a stone island jacket i by default have to become a football fan and fight people it's just the law i don't write it all right it's just the way it is you know what i actually do like that very much it's like a combination of like the casual that i wear and then this combined so it's like a win-win like it oh, it's really nice Nice. Well, that was an easy shop. I'm going for it. Great success. That took me of all the 45 seconds of walking around in it to go, nope, 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 nope. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for my Christmas present. <laughs> Remember, I had that, like, what was it, Kaha coat? Well, we've returned that. We actually returned both of them because Lydia accidentally got two, I think. No, I, I was one wasn't coming time. So she wanted to make sure I, I had one. Twice, yeah. So, new jacket for Christmas. Stop it. And hi ho silver. We're away. Perfect. A mundo. And luckily, we didn't get a parking ticket. Because yes, we did run out of time. <laughs> to the point where I wimped out and put on an extra three minutes. Because <laughs> we're £1.80. So we're home and I'm supposed to be um, grinding down the pool into tiny little pieces. Think it's safe to say we might be saving that task till tomorrow. Um, I'm going to blame Tom Upton for taking us on such a long epic adventure. Hey, listen, it's not a bad thing. I enjoyed it, but he took away my grinding time. Sorry, mate. No room at the inn. It was first come, first serve. And I've got a vlog to get live, which, oh yeah, your boys uploaded it bang on time. If I refresh it, it should say seven minutes ago. Don't worry about it. It was on time. But wait a gosh darn second, I can hear shenanigans. <gasps> How did you get in my house? You little sneaky bugger. How did you get in my house? <laughs> All right, he can stay. And you know what? So can you guys. I've been reading through as many as your guys' comments that have been posted like over oh, the last 38 minutes. All right, don't, don't even say it was 37. The vlog was not late. And I've just been replying to as many as I can because like, I feel like that's the one thing I've been missing from the vlogs recently is not replying to comments enough. And I've been absolutely loving it. Like when I bump into you guys out and about and so many people, like know so much about our lives and our vlogs and stuff like that. Like, I feel like it. I need to be more responsive with you guys because I love talking to you in person about it. So it's like, it's nice to be able to reply to people in the comments. And I just want to say like, thank you to everyone who like, just engages with the videos. You know what I mean? Like I share my life and it's it's so strange you know, having like a one-way conversation. So it's nice to, it's nice to, it's nice to bring it back. And don't you love like how you can see all these replies that I've been doing just four minutes ago, but then in between me refreshing it, look how many more comments we've had down below. Oh my gosh. It's an absolute madness, but we need to go out the house right now because ladies and gentlemen, we've got some news. So, you know, Lydia uh, was pregnant with Alfie. Shocker, science, right? Well, Lydia's best friend 
was pregnant with Ada, and we've not said anything because we waited for them to announce it, but picture on screen, boom, they've had the baby girl. So the night we set off the fireworks, no baby up until midnight or anything out, and she popped out at what time? Um, it's on New Year's Day, 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Oh my goodness. So Ada is now in our lives and we're going down to see her. And it's going to be my first time meeting her, so I'm dead excited. Because for uh, everyone would know, Jenny and Eamon, also known as the Irish guy, are now parents. So we're going to go down, go and meet her and go and congratulate them. So I'm sorry, comment section. I've been replying for 38 minutes, but it's my time to go. I really feel like I should um, potentially take the angle grinder off the table. And guess what? I'm going to wear my new jacket. Oh, yeah. Just thought I'd show you this. When I can't take the tags off because like they're a material like this, I actually get the, bloody hell. I actually get the, um, the torch and I burn it ah! off. I thought I'd burn the jacket then. Luckily I didn't. <laughs> May have just burned my finger. Fuck. <laughs> I should uh, probably move the uh, burning rocket ship from the baby change station. You know, safety first and all that. And I'm gonna grab a bottle of champagne. And not just any champagne, mine and Lydia's favorite. Paul Roger Federer. It's actually called Paul Roger, but whatever. Huh? 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 What do you think of the jacket? Yeah! Oh, you know what? I like it. Picasso. Okay, Dr. Jones, we are out of here. Taxi, wait for me, taxi, wait for me. <sighs> right, no striking meeting your new friend. Comprende? Comprende. Is it go time? Yeah. Oh! Where's the baby? <gasps> oh my God, Alfie looks like he's eating her. Oh my God, she's <laughs> tiny. <gasps> yeah, do you want to guess her? Yeah. That is bizarre how small babies are. <laughs> wait, I should know this, but... Oh my God, Amen! Mate! You're... Don't start crying now. Oh, look at that. What's he What's he happened to got in his uh, his little thing? <gasps> He's brought a bottle of champagne for you. <gasps> Mate, congratulations. Oh, my goodness. Okay, you know what? In person, right? In picture, she looks like Jenny. In person, she looks like you. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Mate, she looks so like you. How much hair has she got? She's got the same. <gasps> Jenny, come here. Wait, come I'm so proud of you. <gasps> You're a mummy. I know. You're a daddy. Oh, come here. Oh my gosh, look at her. Mate, I can't believe it. This is their first time meeting. Stop watching the TV. Stop watching the TV. There we go. Pay attention to the baby. Oh, oh look at that. You've already kicked off me. Oh, little one. Look at the size of her hand. Oh my gosh. Bro, I'm so proud of you. Oh, I just want to kiss you. What? Imagine feeling that after feeling uh, no, that. No, no. <laughs> look at the size different. Look at the size of your head. This is our you. Look at this. This is our life. <laughs> babies, you babies. So big. Yeah, but... Calm down. Sorry, let me turn you up. It, he's like, he's like, whoa. There's boobies here, but these ones aren't mine. <laughs> what is going on? Dude, he's that big now that, look, you can't even put your finger, your hand around his leg. You're a fat gay, aren't you? You big chubby baby. Hey, mate, you never know. That could be your future wifey. <laughs> what is going on? Dude, dude. Hey, Guinness guy's got a baby. Guinness <laughs> baby. That was an easy one. Baby Guinness. Has she got her eyes open? <gasps> wow! Oh, look at you! Look at you! Mate, she's gorgeous. I gotta say, I can't believe you gave her <laughs> your haircut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I had to bring you a bottle of champagne to celebrate, but not just any bottle of champagne, our favourite. Mine, thank you. Paul Roger Federer. <laughs> Paul Roger. Mate, she's so cute. Uh, by the way, do you want a beer? Yeah? You want a beer? Do you fancy a beer as well, mate? <laughs> the pub with us he loves the football. <laughs> no don't watch football we're not interested in that crap but if you grow up and want to go to football your uncle carl will take you oh my goodness me hello little one you okay hi oh you little poser so very nice to meet you so very nice to meet you you absolute button look at the wrinkly hands <laughs> okay maybe you didn't appreciate that comment it's mad it feels like it feels like a lifetime ago that he was this small. Just amazing. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna let you rest now. Um, I'm so proud of you, Jen. Well done. It, it, well. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. Honestly, so proud of you. 
All 10 seconds, eh? All 10 seconds. <laughs> Wait, what on earth is going on? We're just sat here. I'm holding little baby Ada. And Lydia's just pointed to me out. That is someone we know who we went to high school with. Emily Stott. What? How did you just... How did you spot Emily Stott there? No way. Go on, Emily. No freaking way. <laughs> That's amazing! This is the current situation with me and my little dude just sat here. He's actually watching the football on the telly, but listen to how vocal he is. My son's trying. My son's trying to speak to me. Aww. You go, little man. You go. Usually, I talk back to him straight away. And like encourage him to get a response, but I just wanted to get it on camera for you guys. Um, bit of a random transition, but I'm now at the airport with Eamon behind the wheel, and there's no children in sight anywhere. Oh God, are we are we finally leaving them? Yeah. Is that it? Yeah, you you finally given birth, <laughs> and it actually comes true that you are an international drug dealer. This is it. Four days in, I've hence the car, and we are out of here. But how lovely is this? Eamon's mum is flying over to, from Ireland to stay with them to help look after the baby. That's so freaking cute. Wait, ignore Eamon's mum a second. Wait, go forward a bit. Mate, that's sick. Look how good that is for parking your car. You could just press these angled cameras and it shows you like a 3D render of your... <gasps> what? That's sick. I want one. You know what? I, 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 I'm, I'm saying this right now. We might have to put an F-Pace SVR on a S test drive ultimate dad mobile. Oh, wait. F-Pace. Yeah, the F-Pace. Yeah, it is the ultimate Can dad I borrow it for a, 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 an attempt of a day in the yeah. life of a dad? No. <laughs> I'm a great driver. He <laughs> said absolutely not. You slag. Are you excited to see your mammy? Do you call her mammy? Oh, ma'am, sorry. No, I, didn't, I wasn't trying to make that weird. But what if you say, oh, where's your mammy? Or did you just say, where's my mum? Yeah. Yeah, I think, yeah, yeah. I think more what I was going from there, that's Irish in it. Mammy. Where's mammy, my mammy? It's, it's cool. Hey, me mum? Yeah, I wouldn't say it's too common, but yeah. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Oh, look at this. I can't, I can't believe I've come along for this. I just kind of was like, yeah, I'll go. It is a little bit weird to come along for it. But it's you great. invited me! <laughs> and I'm not exactly going to say no. I was like, yeah, sure. Imagine if you would have said, hey, Tom, do you want to come to the airport and pick up my mum with me? And I just went, nope. <laughs> How insensitive does that come across? I was like, do you want to come? Be nice. <laughs> <laughs> you would be nice. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to tell you this as, as a fact right now. I'm the one person you don't offer something to that you don't want them to do. Because I go, uh, someone goes like, oh, you come stay with me for a week at, at my house. And I'll go, okay. <laughs> I have my own house and everything, but I'm still fucking coming. You, you would think I would have learned that lesson by now. No, you clearly have not. Yeah. But Eamon, Terminal 3, we meet again. It feels so good to be back, but kind of sad that I'm here to not be flying off on an adventure. Imagine just me and Eamon actually, we're just like, see you, abandoning you, goodbye. Is that your mum? Is that your mum's today? <laughs> to your right, she looked left. <laughs> to your right! Right, I'll pretend I'm not here, hiding behind the world's smallest pole. <laughs> Wait, you're not going to run up and pick her up and hug her and spin around? Come on, man, content. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I'm you okay? I'm alright. He was just saying he's, he's so excited to see his mummy. Yeah, you, you give me a good tips, yeah? Oh, yeah, he's, no, he's got it. Honestly, he's got it in the bag. He's doing great. I'm very proud of him. I love him. I can't believe he's a dad. You didn't tell me she's now officially a grandma. Yes! <laughs> yeah, can't be, can't be, surely not. I can't believe this is happening, but I'm carrying your own mother's bags. I would insult like the way he's been brought up, but like his, his mum stood right there, so maybe not. Oh, <laughs> look how cute this is. Sorry, it's just a moment. I'm just capturing it forever. Listen, mate, you're terrible at filming things, so I'm gonna catch the moment yeah. your mum, the, your mum meets your daughter. Oh yeah, yeah. Sorry to spoil it. I'll just pretend I'm a leaf on the wall. I think I meant fly. <laughs> your chariot awaits. <laughs> Don't start saying I'm showing you for right. It's called chivalry. You can put Tom in the boot. Why do you, why'd you put me in the boot? <laughs> Carry your own fecking bags. <laughs> What's going on? Are you excited? Oh, I am. Oh, I'm so excited for you. Oh, look at you. What a gentleman. Just, wow. Just incredible. Oh, he's so cool. Actually, that's everywhere here. I know. It's crazy, isn't it? Oh, my gosh.
Oh, oh the photographs are, are lovely, but she's oh. better in reality. No. Oh. Yeah. oh, that's so lovely. Gang, so lovely to see you. Oh. So lovely to meet you. And until next time, yeah, which will probably be tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I won't be surprised. Suits you, Grandma. <laughs> Suits you, Grandma. Oh, look at her, she's awake. Lovely to see you. Come on, little bud, let's get out of here. Okay, let's get little man home. You know what, I don't think I can say little man anymore because you're pretty big. Oh, it is now quarter to one in the morning. I am tired from my 9 a.m. wake-ups. I'm trying to send Orion all the footage for the vlog. And all I can hope is that it came together in some organized way because trying to send the footage from the glasses, my phone and everything is a nightmare. And just in case someone catches me off guard now, I'm currently wearing no pants. Not trying to make this weird. <laughs> I know I know it's hard not to, but for some reason they're just lay there and I'm sat here like this. So let, let's just not talk about it. And instead say, let me know what you thought about today's vlog. Cause obviously I know I use loads of ca uh, camera footage from the actual glasses. And I think for that sort of adventure again, if I go on something as, epic as it was, I need a proper GoPro so you guys can be fully immersed in it. But I just thought Tom was gonna take me through a puddle, not up a green lane, which was absolutely awesome. So let me know your genuine thoughts and opinions about it and whether or not we should stick to GoPro in for that sort of stuff in the future. I think we should. Um, so I'm just gonna apologize for there being so much of it. But if you did actually enjoy it, guys, do me a favor, leave a like ring, click the subscribe button and make sure you ding down that notification bell because we are on the waiting game to hopefully receive a notification as to when the world's brightest torch will arrive. Honestly, I can't wait to get this thing. Like, I'm gonna make so many YouTube shorts with it and YouTube videos with it and just do stupid things with it. Someone was even like, Tom, you should go out like green laning in your Defender and tape it to your roof. And I was like, you son of a gun, I'm in. So if you guys are excited for that, like leave some comments down below. And honestly, thank you for watching the, the vlogs. Like, thanks for wasting your time, watching my time. I appreciate you. And if we're uploading this video now, if I do the Mac, da, 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 you're watching this on a Friday. I hope you have an amazing weekend and I will love you and leave you and see you on Monday, the next weekday vlog. So until then, much love to your faces. And a serious.